Here we have a 2005 Volvo V17 in silver and it comes with the dark grey painted alloys as you can see. Start with the offside front panel. There you go, as you can see there's some small chips, nothing serious though. And then some there and then some there as well, but again that's nothing major at all. There you go, as you can see. Not a lot of tread, I'd say about 3 mil of tread left on that tyre. And then looking at the alloy itself, I have to say I've had a good look, no curbs at all. The only thing I noticed on this wheel was a light scratch there. Other than that, the wheel's in really good condition. Looking down the offside of the car, again, you can't see any signs of any dents at all. Or any scratches in the bodywork, all seems to be in good order. If we just have a look at the offside rear tyre, there you go, as you can see, there's a bit more tread left on this one, I'd say about 4 to 5 mil. And then looking at the wheel, again, no curbing at all or cracks in the wheel. It's actually in really good condition to be fair. They look really nice in uh, the dark grey or the silver. Just move to the back of the car. Uh, nothing really to report with the back, no dents or scratches that I can see at all. I've had a good look. All seems to be good in order at the back of the car. We just have a look at the near side rear tyre, and again, I'd say about five mil by the feel of it. There's about five mil of tread depth. And then looking at the wheel, again, really good condition. Nothing really to report, as you can see from the video. Looking down the near side of the car, the only thing I had to report, sorry, was. At the back, where there is a light scratch, as you can see, it is very light though. And then there does appear to be a light scratch going down the side of the car. It is very light though, so that would touch out very easy. Other than that, it seems to be in good order, no real cosmetic damage. Just above the near side front arch, there are some light scratches, as you can see. Again, nothing major. Looking at the tyre itself, I'd say there's about 3mm of tread left on this tyre. And then, looking at the actual wheel itself. Now this wheel does have, as you can see, quite a good scratch on the side there. And then some light scratches on the top of the wheel there. Other than that, no real damage at all. There's a slight kerb there. Other than that, all four wheels seem to be in good condition. If we just move to the front of the car, as you can see, there's quite a bit of, I think it's a, the actual lack has come off there. And then a bit of a scratch as well. Doesn't appear to be any cracks at all though, or any real damage, no dents at all. So it's all in good order. If we just have a look at the inside of the car. It is full leather interior. It's a little bit worn as you can see. It's a 2005 plate though, so to be fair, it has been looked after inside. There's no real tabs or rips in the seat at all. Just a bit of bit of a bit of wear, sorry. There we go, if we just step inside the car. Now I'll we'll, uh, show the mileage. As you can hear, radio works, sorry. And uh, all the air conditioning works. Everything functions as it should. 
does come with heated seats as well and they all work as well there we go <coughs> 84,355 miles on the clock <coughs> now the vehicle does come with a full franchise service history there you go the first one at 3000 and it is full franchise done at Volvo, 15,000 was the second, 55 for the third, and the last one was serviced at 71,270. The car has had three previous owners, as you can see from the document, and the MOT expires July the 19th, 2013. So it's still got a few good months on that. That's the documents. If we just have a, a quick look in the back of the car. As you can see. Slight bit of wear in the leather. But overall really good condition. Yeah, it's the Volvo V70. I have to say it's a really nice car.